What's going on guys? This is Nick from Budget Bill Garage and today we are back on our $300 400 cubic inch small block Chevy. So if you guys didn't see the last video, I bought this thing for 300 bucks. Um, it turned out to be a 400. I don't really know a lot about 400s, but I put a video out and to be honest, everybody gave me a ton of info. It got a lot of attention and people gave me specs and builds and stuff that they had done. And honestly, I really enjoyed reading all about it. Um, I was gonna just throw this thing in a car, to be honest. It was 300 bucks. I figured it'd be a good episode to throw a $300 motor in a car and not really know whether or not it worked. But after reading all the comments and talking with some of the commenters, I decided to take it apart. They convinced me to take it apart, check if it had steam holes at the very least. So that's what I did. Um, now that it's apart, the I cleaned the pistons up. Everything here looks really great. There's no really, there's no casting number on it or anything. So. I'm assuming the bottom end is stock. So if you're looking at the block, um, I can show you these steam holes that everyone was talking about in the comments. Um, I also have this other 350 small block. I can show you for reference where the steam holes aren't. The heads that were on this thing, they're from a 350 small block. It's just a 70 cc chambered head. Um, they were not drilled. I have the gasket right here. You can see that it's supposed to be drilled. Um, the the heads themselves obviously right here were not and so I gotta decide to either keep them or keep them and drill them or do something different but now that I got this thing down this far I'm kind of wondering where I should go with it and I was kind of hoping everybody in the com um, I was kind of hoping everybody in the comments would kind of tell me um, what do you want to see should I take it all the way down um, no matter what we're gonna put a new cam in it and timing chain set and I'll put a new oil pump in it but I'm kind of wondering if I should take it all the way down, get everything machined, get it rebalanced, and then maybe should I bother using the heads that were on it? Should I just drill the steam holes and throw them on and see what I got? Or should I try and find something new? Maybe something aluminum? I don't know, to be honest, let me know what you think. As far as this thing goes, tear down was, tear down was really easy. Um, I'm kind of excited to see what it turns into though. So really let me know what you guys want to see and if it's achievable, I have some money, not a ton. Um, I'd be happy to build this thing. So let me know. I want to build it the way you guys want to see it built. All right, so that's it for this episode of Budget Build Garage. If you like the episode, if you like the engine, um, if you want to tell me what I should do with this thing, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next episode.